Praise the Lord. Welcome to this series titled Miracles from the Bible. I am Dr. John Sincerian and I will be speaking to you about a miracle in Matthew chapter 2. We read about an angel of the Lord speaking to Joseph in a dream and directing him to go to the land of Egypt. This is what the angel of the Lord said. Arise, take the young child and his mother, flee to Egypt and stay there until I bring you word for Herod will seek the young child to destroy him. And we see Joseph being obedient to the angel of the Lord and he takes Mary and the young Jesus and goes and dwells in Egypt. And after Herod died, we see the angel of the Lord speaking again to Joseph in a dream and telling him, Arise, take the young child and his mother and go to the land of Israel. For those who sought the young child's life are dead. So after the death of Herod, we see Joseph taking Jesus and Mary and coming into the land of Israel. But when Joseph found out that Archelaus, the son of Herod, was reigning there, he was afraid to go there. And God again spoke to him in a dream. And that's why he came and dwelt in the region of Galilee. And he came and dwelt in a city called Nazareth, that it might be fulfilled, which was spoken by the prophets, he shall be called a Nazarene. Praise the Lord. So what's the miracle here, you may ask? See, God speaks to us through His Word. Every day as we read the Word of God, God is speaking to us. But He also speaks through dreams, visions, prophecies, and any other means that He decides to speak to us. Now, God is speaking specifically to Joseph through three dreams here so that He can protect Joseph and his family. God cares for you and me, and He wants us to be under His protection at all times as we seek His face daily. God will speak to us. He will show us the way forward. His Holy Spirit will speak to us and show us the way forward. This is the way, walk in it, will be what He says to us. So let's live close to the Lord and the Lord will fellowship with us continually. May God bless you with these thoughts. Praise the Lord. Thank you.